Coach, second straight weekend on the road. How do you think the team's improved since week one? Uh, you know, I think the, uh, the biggest differences in the team have been their understanding of the intensity required to, to play, um, as well as their understanding of what we're asking um, and, and the scenarios presented in each game allow them more chances to just get the repetition and feel comfortable uh, in what they're doing. So it's been great improvement. How does playing on the road improve a team's makeup and chemistry? You know, just time together. When, you, when you're with somebody that long, that much uh, in just small, tight spaces, you get to learn a little bit more than you probably want to know. Um, but, but that time together is invaluable in, in really developing the closeness and, and the family atmosphere that we're looking for. Huge win early in the season. You beat number nine Notre Dame on the road. What does that do for this team's confidence? Um, the, the more important part is w what happened in game. I, I thought the first half, uh, Notre Dame was very, very good. They were all over us, but we didn't necessarily bring the level we needed to. Um, and then, then to regroup at halftime and have them come out with better energy and find success in the, the intensity that they brought to the game and the, and the details that they changed um, is huge going forward. Yeah, and you mentioned that. I mean, the second half was totally different in that game. Uh, anybody in particular stand out as a game changer in that one? Um, I would have to say um, freshman Sydney Sladek was unbelievable in that game. Um, she did some things just in, in keeping the ball and moving the ball for us and being dynamic uh, with the ball. I thought she was really, really big time and really helped us change uh, our attitude about the game. All five of the goals really this weekend were um, really good team goals. It seemed like they're forming a, a great chemistry, but you know, talk about the goal scoring. And I know, you know, last week in practice too, the buildup, that was something you all were really working on. Well, we spent a lot of time in preseason just getting organized and, and working really back to the middle of the field. And now we spend a little bit more time working middle to front. Um, and so now we're, we're starting to reap the benefits of that labor, um, the repetition, the understanding. And we still have some sharpness to clean up, but um, it was exciting to get you know, gold from a defender um, in both games, gold from uh, different players, players that people don't expect to see. Um, so it's, it's exciting to kind of get, get variety in the goals as well. Your first home game coming up, 4 p.m., UC Riverside, Friday. First time coaching on home turf. How are you feeling about that? I'm just excited, um, especially now the team's feeling good about themselves. Um, I'm really anxious for the, for the fans to be able to come out and be entertained by this group. I think um, we, we play in an exciting style. We play with a lot of passion. We play with some intensity. Um, and it's going to be nice to have a little bit more home fans, although our fans were good on the road. Um, it's going to be, be nice to be in front of the home crowd. So how do you start preparing for UC Riverside? Um, fortunately, we played them in the spring, so we have a little bit understanding of what they bring. They're going to be very organized. They have some dynamic personalities in their attacking front. Um, we're going to have to be focused and move the ball, but uh, really we're still concentrating on um, what we do and, and how to get better um, and be more efficient, starting games a little bit better. That's a, a, an area that we need to improve. So that's going to be our focus this week. And not just starting games better, but how do you keep the team focused? Because you're coming off such a big road win, so emotional. Now, how do you help make sure that they're preparing right for this game Friday? The good thing is we, we are coming home for the first time, and, and that in itself will bring an intensity um, to because they're going to want to please the home crowd. They're going to want to show well in front of the home fans. And so that, that has kept a sharpness about them. And I think they're still feeding off that energy and, and thus training a little bit uh, better. This morning's training was fantastic. 